Alright there YouTube, so I want to welcome you guys back uh, for a follow-up video. This is uh, the video of my Ashley Chime 10 inch mattress. This is a review, this is 30 days later. So I gotta say there's nothing more than a good night's sleep. And that's important for your health and your well-being. So when I get into how the mattress has performed and held up for the last uh, 30 days so far. So I hope you guys uh, enjoy this video. Hello there YouTube. So uh, it's been a little while since I came back uh, to do my video. Uh, I wanted to give you guys a seven day update on uh, my mattress that I got. My 10 inch Astley Chime that I got from uh, Astley Furniture. Uh, it's been a little over seven days. It's actually uh, it's been exactly one month since I bought it. And I uh, just wanted to give you guys an update, let you know uh, how it's working out for me, if it was worth the $249 I spent. Uh, if you should probably look into getting yourself one, or uh, giving it a shot. So, we uh, finish up with this uh, follow-up review with you guys, and uh, tell you my thoughts. So, the mattress itself has uh, pretty much fully expanded to the full 10 inches that it was advertised as. I will say that the mattress is pretty firm. It's a lot firmer than uh, I thought it was going to be. I probably would have tried to find something a little softer, but I've been able to compensate with a mattress pad, which I'm actually going to buy a thicker one, just because I've been my body's kind of adjusted to sleeping in the worn-out bed that I used to have, the bubble peak that was worn. It was kind of sagging, so my spine hasn't quite adjusted to sleeping on the new bed. So it's getting better day by day. My body's kind of adjusting. I feel a lot better. I'm sleeping sound throughout the night, but I think I got probably another couple weeks ago for my body to adjust. I, I'm kind of a, a, a big dude. I weigh like 240 and uh, laying on this, I don't really notice any change in the structure. It doesn't sag or nothing. It seems seems to be pretty strong, pretty durable. It's it holding my weight fine. There's no adjustment aside, aside from it uh, just raising up. Uh, so far, so good. Would I recommend it? I would, for $249, it's a good mattress. Like I said, I, I had to add a pillow top to it, pillow top mattress cover, uh, which seems to be helping out a little bit. Um, I'm sure once my body gets adjusted fully, I'll be enjoying it a lot more. But uh, I figured I'd give you guys an update to this video. This is my follow up. And not much more I can say about it. So for two hundred forty-nine dollars, this was a bed in the box. I rolled it out. It seems to be good. Pretty firm. Uh, it's good. I've been sleeping pretty good. A lot better than the other bed. Obviously, the, when the other bed was new, it was very good. It was actually the best bed I ever had. But I didn't want to spend that kind of money. Especially when I'm uh, going to be getting into a, a, a home in the next year or so, buying my own house. So, <clears throat> so if you guys want to give it a shot, it's not bad for $249. Well, so, I want to say thanks for watching. If uh, you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. If you like my channel, please uh, subscribe. Thanks. See you guys for the next one.